Hello everyone! Welcome back to the channel if you've been here and hello my name is Grace if you've never been here before and you decided to watch this video, welcome! As you can tell by the title, we're kind of welcoming in a new era of my YouTube channel. Also before I keep going, I'm just letting you guys know that this is going to be like a cozy little update video so feel free to, you know, get your laundry, fold it, get some tea, let's just hang out today. <laughs> so if you watched my YouTube video that I posted a couple of days ago, you would maybe have noticed that the first new thing that is going to be rolling out this month is the uploading schedule. So my new upload schedule is going to be every Monday and every other Thursday as well. So instead of just getting one video a week, you might be getting two videos a week. Well, not might. Every other week you'll be getting two videos instead of just one. <laughs> the second change that I made that if you watched last week's video all the way through, you might have possibly noticed, but I switched up the overall look of my channel just a tiny little bit, just a little bit of a few tweaks here and there, nothing crazy, but I'm just excited to kind of do a little bit of a refresh and reset. Anyways, in terms of content, just before you start getting worried or anything, my content, let's talk about it. I feel like a lot of you probably started following me because I was doing all this decluttering stuff and blah blah blah, but now that I've been decluttering my already like not crazy amount of possessions for the past year, I feel like I'm actually at a point where I don't have a ton of stuff left to declutter. Like I'm already pretty much at the bare bones of things that one could own to function in society per se. There's definitely a couple of areas that I still have to declutter and I will be continually doing that as I get older and move on through life. But I will say that the decluttering videos are probably going to happen at less frequent intervals just because I physically don't have that many more things to declutter as a person and next year I'm not going to be buying anything new because I'm doing my no buy year. So that's going to be the new kind of like theme of the minimalism videos for this next year in 2024. It's mostly just going to be the no buy stuff and I'm really excited to get into that because I feel like it's going to be a super interesting challenge and whoever wants to join me on that challenge please feel free. I'm gonna try to be doing it in a very like open concept kind of way so that you can do it yourself. It's a bit of like a how to follow along, like let's check in, how's yours going, how's mine going sort of thing. I don't know if I'm gonna make like a community for it because I don't know if there's like a ton of people that want to do it, but as I post my videos I hope that you guys can follow along and maybe go on some sort of a no buy or low buy journey of your own. But in general, I think I'm going to kind of go back to the idea that I had when I first started the channel and it's kind of like the mission statement of my channel, which is finding realistic ways to create a happy and intentional life. Definitely gonna be keeping it real, gonna be keeping it raw. I'm not gonna do anything like crazy aesthetic, unrealistic, unattainable stuff. Like I'm still gonna be very honest, very realistic, showing up imperfectly as I am, as I do. That's not gonna change. The main shift, I guess, is just gonna be the fact that it's not gonna be like all about minimalism. It's definitely gonna have a bit more other stuff going on. Like I'm definitely gonna be starting to post more bookish content and I will also be posting some more like vlog stuff. And again, it'll probably still be kind of like cleaning vlogs or like, you know, organizing vlogs just because I feel like that kind of like relatable, let's hang out and get stuff done kind of thing is definitely like, where I shine and where I really help me and help you guys at the same time in a way. Having something or someone kind of on in the background while you are getting stuff done, I find very helpful and just, you know, 
calming. I watch videos like that myself, so it makes me happy that I can be that for you guys as well. But I'll also be posting some travel vlogs as I just did a couple of days ago. In general, I'm definitely just gonna be posting a bit more eclectic content instead of like purely minimalism stuff. I feel like I've been kind of inching my way towards that, but in the phase of time where minimalism was very much on my mind a lot and I was trying to get rid of and declutter a lot of things, I feel like I kind of went super ham and didn't like burn myself out, but I was feeling a little bit uninspired. I don't know. I felt like I was like, oh my gosh, I need to like find something to declutter so I can film it and make a video because no one else, like people don't care about whatever else I'm gonna post. They only care about me decluttering and blah, blah, blah. But I was talking to a couple of different people, one of my friends, another one of my friends who's like more of like a marketing person. I actually just met with her today, this morning. And we were just talking about like the way that our brands are going and like our projects and stuff. But yeah, it was just really interesting talking to someone that's also kind of growing from scratch, starting from zero, seeing what rings true to like the kind of stuff that you wanna be posting and how you wanna be helping people essentially. And my target, audience is people like me and looking at my statistics on YouTube it seems like a lot of you are pretty much like me where we work we have a limited amount of energy we want to keep our lives simple and we want to make them as fulfilled as possible with I don't want to say minimal effort but you know, we aren't gonna be having all day to like do crazy stuff. Like we want to get some stuff done, live our little lives, maybe have some fun things going on in the background, like some little hobbies or whatever, or trying to get rid of things and simplify our life. Just easy things like that, like low impact, high reward. Is that the phrase? I don't know. Just the little things that make our lives so much better. And I'm not claiming to be an expert on any of this stuff. I'm just figuring it out just like you guys. I'm just posting about it at the same time. So yeah, I think coming from that place of being imperfect and trying to make it all happen in the best way that I can and uh, posting my experiences, creating a little community and just having fun and keeping it real on here instead of contributing to the perfect aesthetic YouTube side of things, which is totally valid. But I think that sometimes over consuming, like very polished, very, sorry if the light keeps changing. It's just like the clouds are going crazy today right now. Over consuming really polished content or really aspirational or motivational content, over consuming it is sometimes has a negative effect on you because you are constantly comparing yourself to these people and it almost demotivates you. I feel like lately I've been consuming so much motivational content that I'm kind of just feeling more dysregulated in a weird way. Sometimes you kind of just need to unplug and that's just the way it is. And sometimes just having white noise of someone decluttering or cleaning or whatever in the background is like the way to go. And I feel like I've been watching a lot of book talk videos lately because I can just have them on in the background while also doing my dishes and still feeling like stimulated and productive and whatever at the same time. It's just more like ambient content, I guess. I don't know. I feel like that's kind of the niche that I've been falling into lately and I'm totally fine with that. Long story short, not to totally just rant at you guys, this video is essentially just to say that I hope you guys come with me on this next phase of my like YouTube journey or whatever. I'm still obviously gonna be posting about minimalism and simplifying your life and stuff like that, but I just wanted to be super transparent with you guys and say that the decluttering content is definitely ramping down because I physically don't have that many more things to declutter that at least I personally own. As many of you know that follow along with this channel, I'm living in the apartment that my boyfriend's family grew up in. So a lot of the stuff that is here is his family's or his mom's or whatever. So there's only so much I can do. And I don't really own that much stuff because it's all things that I've basically just acquired from college onwards. So anyways, that's basically it. I just wanted to give you guys a little update. Sorry that this wasn't like an exciting video or anything, but I have plenty more content coming up for you guys this month and for the rest of the year. And I'm super excited to get into our no buy 
stuff. So I'm gonna Western, we're gonna do it together, okay? We're gonna have a great time, it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna save a bunch of money and it's gonna be great. So yeah, I, the sun is just, I don't know what to do. <laughs> So I'm really excited. I hope you guys stick around and uh, make sure that you're subscribed if you haven't subscribed yet. Also, I'm shocked that you aren't if you're watching this video all the way to the end. I feel like why would you care if you weren't actually subscribed, but I don't know. And make sure that you have your notification on so you see all the videos that I post instead of missing some and you know missing updates or whatever. And that's uh, pretty much it. Please. Let me know in the comments what kind of other extra content that you would like to see from me. Thank you guys so much for following along. I truly feel so, so lucky to have this little corner of the internet and I'm so thankful for all of you that tune into my videos every week and leave such kind messages in the comments. It, it really like makes my whole week and it just makes me so happy that we have each other. Truly, I feel that way and um, yeah. Anyways, I will see you guys next week and until then, I'm sending you all my love because we're just trying our best out here. Sorry about the lighting this whole time. Oh my gosh, what's going on? I'll see you guys next week. Bye.